Hello everyone, happy to see you here and welcome back to my channel Brain Logic. In this video we are going to solve this really interesting, I would say like very simple and relaxing in the same way this is very tricky and relaxing question. We have 12 plus 24 divided by 2. On the first side this is the most simple question you've ever seen, this is a very easy question, yeah? We have 12 plus 24 divided by 2, so very simple numbers, not like a huge numbers right here, so what is the correct answer? We have 12 plus 24 divided by 2. Right here we have three options, option A, option B, option C. So right now I suggest you to pause the video and try to solve it by yourself. Choose one option, what do you think is a correct? I swear it will be really interesting to check our answers in the end of the video on the, or to check your school knowledge, to check your algebra skill. This is very easy and relaxing, relaxing question. But let's try to check our answers. First of all, we have 12 plus 24 divided by 2. Let's rewrite our question right here. So we have 12 plus 24 divided by 2. I want to start with this with this solution, so take a look closely. One part of student, I'm pretty sure, one part of you solved it like that. We have 12 plus 24, let's go from left to right, we have 12 plus 24 equal to 36. 36 divided by 2 equal to equal to 18, yeah? And as you can see, we have this option, this is option A, and one part of students solve it like that, they say, okay, option A is a correct answer, they just go from, from left to right. But then I ask them, what about order of operation right here? Why you start with addition, then division, maybe a division, then addition? So here's our question. And let's solve this correctly according to the correct order of operation, because it looks like we go from, from left to right, we don't care about uh, operations right here at all, because we start with addition, then division. Is it correct or not correct? Let's look at our correct order of operation. For this question, I have this PMDMC order of operation. This is the main, the most popular order of operation in the world. All internet libraries, mass libraries, of course, scientific graphing calculator works according to PMDMC. This is the main order of operation. And let's solve this according to PMDMC. And of course, we will check our answers with this 18. Maybe it will be the same answer. I don't know about it. So we have 12 plus 24 divided by divided by 2. So here's once more our question and let's look at this PMDMC. This PMDMC works from the top to the bottom and we need to now we need to scan. Okay, let's look at it step by step. First of all, parentheses. Are there any parentheses right here? No, I don't see any of those. We don't have any parentheses, which is which is really great. We don't have any parentheses, so we just go to the next step. We cancel this step, we stop this step. Okay, the next step, exponents. So are there any exponents right here? Let's look at it, squares, cubes. You know, I don't see any of those. So we just skip this part, which is which is really great because with exponent, it will be like more complicated expression. We don't have parentheses, we don't have exponent, which is which is really great, which is fantastic. Okay, the next step, as you can see, the third step, multiplication. But a lot of students do this common mistake. They say, okay, multiplication, now we need to multiply it first. But I answer them, okay, we need to add to this multiplication, we need to add this division because multiplication and division, this is one common group right here. And we need to look at it as a group. So multiplication and division, this is one group. And also addition and subtraction, this is the same group. Yeah, this is another group, but the same group. Addition and subtraction and multiplication and division. Let's look at it because the next step, according to PMDMC, is multiplication and division part. Let's look at it. Where do we have this multiplication and division sign? Right here, addition, this is not good. Right here, yeah, we have division right here. So this is our expression that we really need right now because the next step is to divide. Because as you can see, multiplication and division is before addition and subtraction. So whatever expression you have, like a long, a complicated expression, if you have only multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction without parentheses and exponents, you need to divide and multiply it first from left to right, and then you need to add, okay? 24 divided by 2 equal to equal to 12, and we still have this 12 in the beginning, so 12 plus 12 plus 12 equal to 24. Yeah, this is 24, but here's our question. We don't have this option 24 right here, which is really, really weird for a lot of students because then they don't see this. Maybe some part of students solve it like that, but then they go back to this wrong answer because they say, okay, we don't have this 24. Then they go back with this maybe obvious solution for everyone because from left to right, addition, then division, which is right now I'm going to tell that this is absolutely wrong solution. You cannot go from addition, then you, you division. This is a very big mistake, so you need to go from division and addition. And according to PMDMC, correct answer is 24. This is very important moment. So forget this 18, this is a very bad solution, according to PMDMC. And remember that multiplication and division is before addition and subtraction. So you just need to divide, multiply it first, then you can easily add and subtract from, from left to right. So this is not option A. This is not option C, because uh, this is 24, this is not the same as 16. So 
What is the correct answer? As I told before, a correct answer to this question, to this expression, is 24. But right here we have test and we need to find a correct answer. But we still have one option, 4 factorial. Let's look at this 4 factorial because this is our last chance right here. We don't have this option 24 and it's it's kind of weird, weird question. 4 factorial, this is a product from 1 to 4. So 1 times 2 times 3 times 4. Let's look at it. This is our last hope right here. 1 times 2 times 3, we have 6. 6 times 4, yeah, we have, we have 24. So as you can see, this 4 factorial, this is the same as 24, but this is in factorial way, this is uh, exact value of this 4 factorial. So as you can see, our question to this test, so our answer, our answer, this is option, option B, because this 24, this is the same as this 24. So according to this question, 12 plus 24 divided by 2, correct answer is 24. According to our test, correct answer is 4 factorial, which is option option B. So I hope your answer is the same as mine, but definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. I wish you all the best in your mathematic adventures. Thank you for your time and have a great day.